Okay, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can select multiple pictures for printing um, without using any special software in Windows 7. Um, there's two ways of doing this. One of them is you can simply hold down the control key on your keyboard. Um, the control key is located at the bottom left hand corner of your keyboard. Um, simply hold down the control key and just click with the mouse on each picture that you wish to be printed. You can do it with that way or there's another way. Um, you can have um, check boxes on each of these pictures which you can uh, click to select. Um, there's a way of setting this up. Um, if you go to the organized uh, button right at the top, uh, if you then go down to folder and search options, click on that. Um, now you're in the fol folder options box. Um, if you go to view, click on that. And as you can see there's a scroll box here. If you just scroll down right to the bottom, and there should be a tick box here and it says use checkboxes to select icon, uh, items. If you click on that one uh, and then you go to apply and OK. Now um, every time you hover over a photo you see this tiny little checkbox up the top here. Um, so let's say I want this photo to be printed. I just give a little click on that little box. Hover over to the next photo you wish to be printed and click on that one and just click on any ones you like. So I'm going to do four. Uh, so you just click in each of the boxes. So now you see I've got four pictures selected. Um, they've each got a tick box in. Um, so now I'm going to show you how to how you would go about printing um, these pictures. So um, you'd go right up to the top and you would click on print. This opens the print box and as you can see here, I because I had four pictures selected, it says I've got one of four here, and you can click on the arrows to navigate between the four. Um, as you see, I've got each photo on one page. If I want to have, let's say, two on one page, um, you can go on the side here, and you can see it gives you a few options. Um, you click on this one, and I have two pictures on each page. Um, you scroll down using the left hand, uh, the right hand menu, sorry. Uh, and you can have four on one page, you can do like this. Um, this tick box here, um, it fits picture to frame. Um, if you untick that, um, it gives you a border around uh, the pictures, um, which I don't really want, so I'll, I usually leave this ticked. Um, you can have uh, more than one copy of each picture by using the up and down arrows, as you can see here. Um, doing this um, would have more than one copy, as you can see. I'm going to leave that as one. Up the top here um, where it says printer you can select your printer. Um, this is usually set by default um, if your printer is set up you shouldn't have to touch this setting um, but if you've got multiple printers installed then you can use this to select um, a, a different printer. You can choose your paper size um, right here and if you go to more you can uh, select even more than what's listed um, by default. The quality, I never usually touch this, um, so I would leave that as it is. Um, you can then go down to print and it will start printing um, the, the pictures you've chose. I hope this helps you and um, thanks for watching.